Check this out. It's another great new store coming over here in this amazing new mall. I'm sure you guys know already this mall. This is the Isle 9 in Jackson. Right over there is the ice cream store, Snippet. Right over here we have a new store coming over here, Rosemary. It's basically a bagel store. Here's the owner. Shalom, my friend. How are you? What's doing? Ellie Katz. Guys, I'm sure you know him from, he was the manager at Cafeteria for the past, how many years? Four years? Four, five years. Yeah. So he comes with a lot of experience and he's coming out with a very nice, beautiful bagel store. Something that pays the weight, right? Definitely. So let, let's hear. Ready, waiting for. Guys, first we'll see this. What's going on over here? There's a drive-through. So they're gonna have right over here, side of the store, two lanes coming out from around the building. Ellie, why are you having two lanes? So the way it was built, we have it separated. We have uh, the way we structured it. It's gonna be a designated pickup lane for people who ordered online, people who ordered on the phone before they actually came to the store. It'll be a super quick designated pickup lane you can just drive up to the window and grab your order and keep going and for the people that didn't order in advance we have a separate lane for the with a nice big display menu screen with the intercom that they can order like a classic drive through and then they'll come to pick it up from the window afterwards very cool now Ellie explain us about your concept of your store is it just a bagel store I'm sure there's more than so just bagels obviously aside the delicious you know kettle boiled bagels that we're making you know in the brick oven that you know will be something like you know hopefully no one ever tasted before um, it's gonna be we spent a lot of money on the design of the store and uh, you know it's gonna be an experience to sit down and you know even just to enjoy a good breakfast or absolutely and I'm sure and sure the nice decor spent a lot of money on that I saw I saw the specs a little bit so we're still a little bit on the construction we're finishing up the rest of the rest of the job well over here is going to be a nice seating area about about 40 seats we're going to have against this wall is going to be a couple of booths with some couches seating area and some tables against the wall we're going to have a, a nice bar with a couple of uh, bar seating on this side we're going to have the way the ordering is going to work we have a few options aside from obviously ordering online on the app and picking up in the drive through we'll have kiosks for ordering against this wall and then we'll have like a classic ordering at the counter with employees wow order. nice size counter space over here mm -hmm. so over here is going to be all the bagels and spreads and salads and filled so it's a little different than a classic bagel store the ordering is going to be up front and the fruit pepper is going to be in the back so we have the windows from the kitchen they're going to prep the bagels and everything in the back and then pass it through to the front for the employees to pack it up. Okay, right over here, what's this side of the counter space? So in this area, we're going to have a classic, all the regular delicious, uh, delicious brewed coffees, a few different options, top of the line coffee, um, as well as, you know, the specialty drinks, frappuccinos, lattes, cappuccinos, uh, refreshers, you know, the, that everybody likes. Can I show the kitchen for one yeah, minute? Still in the kitchen. I see expensive stuff over here. Construction, but like I said, we have the whole prep area to make the bagels with the griddle, scrambled and eggs, and all, even the hot food. Brick oven, four shelf rotating bagel oven. This is for the kettle cooking. Kettle right here. Nice mixer. Walk-in fridge and mixer. Wow, what's this over here? This is the ice cream machine. This is gonna be for very expensive machine, special for like a slush. Flush coffee type of wow. Thing. So Ellie, when is the big day? So Mitzvahem. Well, right after Yontif, we're looking to to open, and uh, I mean we obviously we don't want to open when we're not 100 percent ready. So we're looking to we're looking to uh, you know be 100 percent and ready to serve everybody without any hiccups and without missing items or things like that when we're ready to open with a bang. Absolutely. So, uh, you know, it's a big area, a lot, you know, busy area. A lot of neighborhoods around, a lot of neighborhoods coming to the area. We're looking forward to serving everybody. Anyone on their way to uh, the 195 on, you know, at 7 o'clock in the morning to go to work. We're going to be open early. We're going to be open 
Geweldig, Elias. We do lots of atslochen. Thank you.